Hey folks, I'm uh, gonna do some unboxings for you. I'm gonna do them in separate videos because I could tell last time nobody liked the fact that my uh, unboxing video of Finding Dory was an hour long. <laughs> but Okay, so we're just gonna do one item per video so uh, this doesn't go crazy. Um, and it's a surprise that I'm doing some unboxing videos tonight. I'm gonna do like four unboxing videos tonight. I sold some stuff online. So I picked up a few things that I wanted that I didn't expect to get to pick up. But then I got laid off my job. So I kind of regret buying stuff. But <laughs> uh, they gave us a good severance package when they laid us all off. So um, not such a bad deal. I mean, I wasn't expecting to stay in that job forever. But I was there for four years, which was kind of unintentional. But, you know, you get comfortable. <laughs> but... Uh, so yeah, I'm going to be on the job hunt soon. Um, I'm going to try to enjoy Thanksgiving first. But I did pick up some items. Um, and I have a few on order. <laughs> yeah, I, I really didn't expect the uh, sudden... Uh, I should have expected to be laid off because se things seemed to be going that way. But then there was it seemed like there was hope that we wouldn't. Whatever. <laughs> I'm having a little vacation right now. And like I said, they gave us a good severance package, so everything should be cool if it doesn't take me as long to find a job this time as it did before. I, I'm just terrible at interviews. So bad. But um, <laughs> I picked up Sailor Moon, the limited edition. This is uh, the S season. This is season three of the original show uh, that I didn't expect to be able to get so soon, but I, I, I got it. And uh, this is the like that deluxe edition that has a slot there for when you get the next part. Because this is part one of season three. And there's a slot there for the next part. And again, this is the original show. This is the 19, was it 1989? Well, we saw it in the 90s, but I feel like it came on in the late 80s. I, I don't know. But <laughs> I'm a big Sailor Moon fan. I should know more about the show, but... I only have so much time that I get to spend on this stuff. I haven't gotten to watch these sets. I have I have the or first season. I have the R season, and I haven't gotten to watch them. Um, and I do have the the deluxe set for the first season, but uh, the second season I forgot about these deluxe sets, and I just bought the regular version. So I still want to try to get that. But yeah, I'm gonna unbox this for you guys, and uh, let's see what it looks like inside. And uh, get, a, get a good look at it before I do. I got this at Best Buy. And it was like $64.99. And I just saw that they have it on Amazon for, I think, $62.99. It's Blu-ray DVD combo pack. And uh, there's the side. You can see it's got part one on Blu-ray. And it's got a, a little book. That's something else you get in these deluxe versions. They call them limited edition versions. And then there's this uh, this uh, cardboard piece that is just a placeholder until you get part two to slide in there. And there's the spine. Last time when I was doing Finding Dory, I held the spine upside down. Let me see. Am I doing that right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't know if you've seen that in reverse as I film it, but Sailor Moon S. And what does that say? Season three. It, yeah, and so this is the new dubs of the original show. This is not the Deke. Well, actually, they didn't have Deke version of this. They had, um, I don't think season, the S season was, was Deke. I don't think, I think uh, it was on Cartoon Network before they, so I, I forget what company started doing the, the dubbing. I think Pioneer was releasing it on DVD at that time, which I really need to get those old DVDs because I love those old dubs. Because I, uh, you know, I got into the show with Deke and I got into the show with the Cartoon Network. Well, I didn't watch all of this. I haven't seen all of this season at all. I've seen the Deke stuff really well. I'm a big Sailor Moon fan from the Deke stuff. I know that's terrible, but that's what was on TV. And by the time it got to Cartoon Network, I didn't have as much time to catch it. It was on, I don't know, I, I think I was having a, uh, taking a stab at, at grad school at that time, which I didn't. I only got about halfway through and I was like, uh. <laughs> but um, so anyway, I'm going to open this up. Uh, talking about Findy Dory really quickly. Uh, I did that video about how I 
chose not to get the steel book because I, I couldn't really afford it and I didn't want to wait until <laughs> I, I could have got that steel book. They, they actually have plenty. Um, you just never know with these steel books. You never know if they're going to get like three copies or they're going to get a buttload of copies and they got a buttload of copies. You can go down to Target right now, get Finding Dory in a steel book. So I just got the regular one. It's it's okay. It was it was a big price difference, uh, but but I would have paid it if I, if I just had the patience. But I wanted to watch that movie that night. I had seen it in theaters, but it was, it's a great movie. But anyway, Sailor Moon. <laughs> okay, my one of my biggest cartoon crushes right there. And uh, on the back you have uh, Sailor uh, Neptune and Sailor Pluto. They are, if you don't know Sailor Moon, they are lesbian lovers, as I believe. Uh, they, um, they were presented as cousins in the American version. Uh, but now we're going to we get the real story now, apparently, with these. I haven't watched them. Um, but, uh, yeah, so there's a little description back here. And uh, continue your collection with 19 uncut episodes. That's key. This is... These new releases are uncut stuff. You're not missing episodes or anything. Presented for the first time on Blu-ray and loaded with never before seen extras. This set also includes a 96 page full color booklet and is housed in a premium chipboard box with room for part two. There's the description of the show. And you got cast interviews, trailers, an art gallery, opening and ending songs, and more. Six discs, uh, six discs, six disc Blu-ray and DVD combo pack, 19 episodes, 1080p. This is terrible, but I've got this huge Blu-ray collection. RTV is not 1080p. RTV is, I think, what what is it? 720? What's the one right below 1080p? We haven't gotten a 1080p DVD, blue, uh, TV yet. But um, aspect ratio, 4x3. English stereo and Japanese audio and English subtitles so you can watch it in English with new dubbing you can watch it in uh, in Japanese and you can put English subtitles on there if you want and some a uh, bit of news that I mentioned uh, on my last video one of the things that stretched the video out so long is that um, they are releasing the movie I believe January 17th the first Sailor Moon movie, these are old movies, they made three movies. They made Sailor Moon uh, R the movie, Sailor Moon S the movie, Sailor Moon Super S the movie, and I think each movie came at the end of the season of the same title, I think. Uh, and uh, Sailor Moon R, this is Sailor Moon S, so I guess this would come right after the Sailor Moon R movie. Um, and that movie is going to be released in theaters here in the United States in mid-January. I'm really excited. I hope I don't miss it, but yeah. And uh, so th that's something to put on your calendars there because that's pretty cool. Um, and hopefully they'll release all three of the movies. This is from Viz Media, and I think they're doing that whole movie release, and I guess it's to tie in with these with these new, new dubbed Blu-rays, and I think the new movies, the new releases in theater of the movies will have these new dubbed voices. And they'll be, uh, I think I've heard that the, because I have the the old DVD releases uh, of the uh, of the movies that had like the Cartoon Network voice actors dubbing it. Um, and I heard that those are like American cuts of the movies. And th this, these are going to be like the full cuts of the movies as they come out. Uh, and I suppose they'll be putting them out on Blu-ray right after the theatrical releases. And uh, so let's let's open this up. Because I don't want to stretch this out to an hour-long video and get a bunch of thumbs down. Because people can't stop the video on their own. <laughs> okay. Yes. That's okay. I'm reading stuff on the back here. Okay. Yeah. And this is a cardboard piece. So you're going to... If you want to keep that, you can. But they also sell these sets for the new show, uh, Sailor Moon... Uh, crystal and I do have there, there's one has come out of that uh, the first season 
And I think it's the whole season in one set. And I've got it. I haven't watched that yet either. Never seen Sailor Moon Crystal except for like the first three episodes. And uh, they haven't released in America. They haven't released the, the live action show. I have a, a bootleg version uh, that I got off off eBay. And uh, and a separate DVD that is the... Uh, they did a couple of specials also. Uh, the, I haven't watched the specials DVD, but the uh, the collection I have of the show, the live action show, you watch a few episodes and it's really cool and interesting, and then the subtitles start to make less and less sense, and the show gets really weird. <laughs> but so I, I didn't get very far, but I need to go watch those at some point. Anyway, here's the case without the paper sleeve that that describes everything. You've got that nice locket symbol there and design and then these little pretty little designs here and there there what does that say that says Neko Tekuchi I don't know if I pronounce things correctly PM that's the correct you know toy animation 1994 oh 1994 so I guess so this, maybe it's just a 90s show not an 80s show I don't know where I got the idea that it, I thought it like came out in like 89 I don't know very pretty cover there I gotta get the deluxe case for my second season I tell you and there you go same thing there <laughs> so let's uh let's empty it out and see what we got well, there's the placeholder. I'm just gonna the placeholder. I'm just gonna leave inside. There. Well, it's you know it's got actually it's they make it pretty for some reason. <laughs> if you uh, really look at the placeholder, it has like this faint moon there and some little designs around it on both sides. I don't know if you can see that. It's very faint. But yeah, that's the placeholder. So what you get in the case is the Blu-ray and this little booklet. Let's look at the booklet. Limited edition booklet. I'm just gonna give you a flip through. I don't know what all that is about. We got some good illustrations there towards the back. That's pretty cool. Oh, it's, it's uh, got little descriptions of each episode, so it's like an episode guide. Okay, cool. That's actually pretty neat. And then it's got a big some credits pages. And then you have all these, all the nice art pictures. The little character descriptions and stuff. I wonder what the other, <laughs> I need to take a look at the other books. I didn't do um, unboxings of the books for, um, well, for the first season. I don't have the one for the second season. Pretty sure there's a book in there too. Now the Sailor Moon Crystal, I did do an unboxing for that, and it did have a also had a book in there. So here's a Blu-ray. It's a different picture from the cover, and this is this is what's on the back of here. I guess if you just buy the Blu-ray, this is what you get. And I think you can also get these on just DVD. Now this set comes with Blu-ray and DVD. It doesn't come with a digital copy. And this picture is different from dropping everything from this one. Drop my book. Okay, so inside we've got that many discs. <laughs> what is that? One, two, three four, five, six. Disc one, episodes 90 through 96, 97 through 102. They have different character art on each disc. Sailor Moon in, in uh, line art. Sailor Uranus. There's Sailor Neptune, and here's Sailor Moon again. Okay, I got confused there because it had the same. Okay, so these these are the same, you know, art because the first three are the uh, the first three are the Blu-ray, and these three are DVD. 
Now I like to get DVDs even more than digital copies because when I watch digital copies, I watch them on uh, Voodoo. They don't play that well. I don't know if our inter internet connection is not good enough or what, but our Wi-Fi. But uh, I mean, our Netflix plays fine. I'm, I'm talking about like in the den over there. Our Netflix uh, plays fine. Our Hulu plays fine. Voodoo doesn't play so good. Our digital copies don't play so good. So I like to get DVDs because here uh, in my bedroom where I have the desktop computer, not, neither of us have a lot laptop. I live I live with my I share an apartment with my sister. And uh, we don't have a desktop, we just share this, uh, I mean, we don't have a laptop, we share a desktop. And uh, all I can play on it at the moment are, um, are DVDs, because it doesn't play Blu-rays. So I appreciate getting uh, these, because the Hulu, I mean, Hulu's fine. The Voodoo doesn't work good on here. So, I, you know, digital copies, I like having them, but I, I, can, I can watch them better on my phone than I can on... The TV or here, they're always like buffering. They start buffering like part way through, and sometimes they'll let me watch the standard deaf version. I mean, I can get up and go get the disc, but what's the point of the digital copy? And in here, I could have watched the digital copy, but no, it doesn't doesn't work. So, <laughs> so I appreciate the DVDs. But anyway, so there you go. Inside was uh, just the discs. So there wasn't any kind of pamphlet, right? You don't need a pamphlet. You got a book. <laughs> so yeah, just straight up you get the discs here and you got the the DVDs and the Blu-rays. And there is there is some art back there, so I guess we'll take a look. I hate popping my discs out if I don't actually have to, but let me show you guys anyway. Now, I, I haven't seen this season thoroughly and it's been a long time, so I don't remember who these characters are. I'm guessing they're villains. Is that Birdie in the game? No, Birdie's from earlier. I don't know who, who those very attractive villains. <laughs> Pop that disc back in. As a collector of discs, I really am sensitive about getting fingerprints on my discs and dust and stuff. So if I'm not going to watch them, I hate popping them out. But they're popping out nicely. It's not difficult. another uh, it's a you know makes a big full illustration so these are more of that group of, of girls I guess attractive villains I assume and there you go Sailor Moon the limited edition version of limited edition release of uh, part one of Sailor Moon S, which is season three of the original show with new dubs, new dubbed voices. And this is full uncut version. So you can get these sets on Amazon or best at Best Buy. I got this in store at Best Buy. Um, I don't know if the price will probably go up. They usually do. I think they can go, they go up to like, I think the suggested retail price or like, Right now, Amazon.com says it's $62.19, and the little crossed-out price is $79.99. Uh, so, <laughs> I don't know if they ever have it at that price, but Best Buy will probably jack it, back, jack it up to $79 <laughs> after, after this first week is over. So, tomorrow is, well, when this video gets posted, technically it's already Saturday, so, you know, I, I'd get it now while it's on sale. Although with Black Friday coming up, this might be on sale all week, I don't know, the coming week maybe. But I'd get it tomorrow to be safe. If you want to, you know, get it for 60 something. I got it for 64.99 at Best Buy. Very nice. Highly recommend it because I love this show. Because I love anime girls, I think they're super cute. I'm mainly a Disney guy above anime, but anime girls, I'm into kawaii cute girls with big eyes and you know cutesy voices and short skirts and all that so i like i like anime girls and i sailor moon girls are my favorite uh especially the five inner scouts especially sailor moon so yeah there it is pick it up and i'm gonna 
uh, end this video and say bye and start working on a couple of action figure videos I'm about to do three actually okay catch you later